Hey guys, hope you all are doing well. I am back with a GTX 1650 benchmark video. In this video, I will show you the benchmark of Ghost Runner in Acer Nitro 5. This game released recently, so most of you guys will be unaware of the game and gameplay. This is a cyberpunk style FPP slasher game. The game is just insane. No matter whether you're a pro gamer, you'll die like 100 times in most levels, and you'll get mad. But still, if you are a hardcore gamer, or someone who likes to play tough games, then this is a must-play game. If you do end up enjoying this video, then please like, and subscribe. Without further ado, let's dive in. adjusting to the software. I'm in a prison. I can calibrate only a basic protocols from in here. It'll have to suffice for now. A trespasser spotted at Metro Station. This is bad. You'll have to fight your way out of here. Air ducts lead to another sector. God, your software is a mess. I've rebooted your acceleration module. You should be able to squeeze through that turbine.
the jack. Right. You wouldn't know. It's the code name we used for you during the repair. Diego said you were all jacked up when he found you and it stuck. Do you mind if I call you that? No. Filtering facility is just ahead. Why is Mara doing this? It's punishment for rebelling against her. She wants to make an example of us to keep the other sectors in line. Sometimes even your current speed won't be enough. Look for cyber void uplinks to temporarily disable safety limiters and increase acceleration. Use them sparingly, though. You don't want to damage yourself. What are these uplinks? Think of them as loose cables you can grab onto for extra power. Although they can be much more dangerous than electricity.
That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you soon.